We still don't see too many wines from Moldova on the shelves. Uh, like many of those former Soviet republics, uh, the fall of communism around 1990, the early 90s, uh, led to a stage where vineyards had to be kind of repatriated, new owners had to be found after the years of state control. And it's taken you know, a good couple of decades for the wineries uh, to re-establish themselves and to find real quality again, now that things have settled down. So my wine of the week this week comes uh, from Moldova. It is the Purkari Estate Rara Niagara 2011. It's being sold by, uh, of all people, Berry Brothers and Rudd, the most you know, traditional of wine merchants, at a price of £11.95, although that price drops to £10.75 if you buy it by the bottle. The Berry Brothers and Rudd, uh, much, much more kind of forward thinking than you might imagine for a company founded well over 300 years ago and still operating from the same building, the same headquarters in London, St James's. But they have expanded their horizons, wines from all over the world, including this one. The grape variety is Rara Niagara, an indigenous grape, and as I say, comes from a winery that was uh, founded in the middle of the 19th century with a great tradition, but totally modern winery. This wine made in stainless steel with no oak barrels involved. It's all about the fruit. On the nose, it's really attractive. There's a lovely tobacco and spice lift to this, as well as that something quite floral to it too. It reminds me a little bit of somewhere between Sangiovese and Malbec, maybe, in terms of those aromatics. Lovely cherry fruit too, another Sangiovese signature. And onto the palate. Delightful. Really sweet red currant fruit here. Something that's very crisp, dry, but sweet, perhaps like juicy pomegranate seeds, perhaps. Also that red currenty fruit, lovely cherry underneath. And although there's no oak, there is a softness to this. The tannins are very silky. Tannins are quite chocolatey in their texture, which gives it that feeling as if it had a little touch of oak just to let it breathe, just to ease it out slightly. But the very good acidity stays there, keeping this nicely focused. It's a delicious style, abundantly fruity, yet not heavy in any way. As I say, Sangiovese Malbec, touches of Pinot Noir in there too. All of those slightly lighter flavours are possible and are found in this intriguing and I think extremely high quality wine. So my wine of the week is the Purcari Estate Rara Niagara 2011. It comes from Moldova and it's being sold by Berry Brothers and Rudd at £11.95 a bottle or £10.75 by the case. This is my wine of the week.